But also, Risley, you need to get new guards. Like, you suck. Why did you let that guy in? Your Grace, we have taken the society members into custody. They all tried to flee just a little while ago, as if they had received some kind of order. We decided to forestall their plan, and were just about to send the word when you unexpectedly arrived. Great work, everyone. But where are Vis and Poisson? for something like this all along? I had them stay here to keep an eye on things, so I'm glad that my intuition turned out to be correct. Perform a thorough search of the Society's headquarters and bring all the members to me. Understood, Your Grace. Now, let's check on them. As expected, they all have a hollow thorn inserted into a wound on their head. Ooh! My mind's glad her eyesight isn't so good that she can see it from here. I... Disgusting. I'm just gonna float away for a bit. They didn't pull the thorn out? They probably left it there as a lasting reminder of Dugier's censure. These people must have had to endure an unimaginable amount of pain. <laughs> Let's go check out the other areas, too. Disgusting. What if your skin, like, heals around the thorn? These papers are actually outdated, but they look brand new. It seems like no one has ever flipped through them. If you look closely, even the creases are almost identical. They don't seem to have been formed naturally through reading. Hey, come here! Have a look at this! This is a book that Paimon found in a box next to the bookshelf. Its contents are exactly the same as this book on the shelf. The colors of the covers are completely different, though. And the names of the authors also don't match up. So these were also just for show. Yeah, and they dared to claim that they wrote these too. Huh. Look at what I found. Is that, like, an item that lets these people be spied on? This, this is... This is a surveillance port. It is. With this, Dugier would be able to remotely monitor everything that's happening at the gathering place. So even if Dugier's not there in person, he'll still always have eyes on the members. That explained why they were all so terrified. Indeed. It's easy to become lost and confused when you're given no instructions or any kind of script to follow. And if any action you take may be deemed a mistake, then perhaps it's better to do less, or to not do anything at all. Dugier has already tamed them to his will. Your Grace! Your Grace! What's the matter? We couldn't find any society members in the other areas. It also seems like none of the equipment in those rooms were ever used. All the signs of wear and tear are fake. The lime scale, the layers of dust, they were all deliberately added. We also investigated the members' residences and weren't able to find anything. Their neighbors all say that they haven't returned home for ages. Oh. Is that right? They're gone? That could only mean... The society put a lot of effort into building a front. Indeed. As long as he allowed society members to mingle with others, even with threats of censure, Dugier knew that he couldn't stop all of his members from speaking out. Meanwhile, this marvelous gathering place will lose all of its value as soon as a whistleblower sounds the alarm. So instead of being his real base, this is just an elaborate performance. The rest areas, the fancy equipment, even the members that we saw, they were merely part of the front. And only the most docile and well-trained members were selected as his performers. 
Are we going to finally get to go into that underground thing I found that I could not find a way into? But then, where can we actually find him? <sighs> Let me think. Dujie must be holding all the rest of his members in another place. And if the overseer of my fortress guard has never alerted me to anything of the sort, he must be in Dujie's pocket. Well, he could tell us where the real headquarters are. I'm of the same mind. Let's go. And that would explain you follow me. why the guards let Dujie in instead of stopping him, or at least insisting he knock. Oh, it's down. We teleport. We cutscene. Did that person flee here? That's the most likely scenario to me. He's probably already caught wind of Dujier's declaration of war against me and has fled to seek his protection. Let's keep heading down. There are some abandoned areas in there. Since he needs space, I guess Dujier probably converted them into his headquarters. We should be on the right track. Now we just need to find that turncoat. Let's go. We can take this path. You guys take the other. Where are we going? Investigate the production zone with Risley. Okay. After them. It's Run. I'm gonna get you. <sighs> did Dujier send you? Why did you attack that guard? <sighs> I will take your cooperation into consideration when it comes time to hand out sentences. But, but Mr. Dugier, he, he didn't want this guy to expose our true location. We were just about to dispose of him when you caught up to us. So, in other words, your headquarters should be this way. <sighs> yes, it's just down this way. You'll make it there once you've seen it pass through a large drainage pipe. Now that's more like it. Guards, take them away. Let's go. It's about time Rice that we Lee. find out what Dujier is really after. You really need a clean house. I thought you ran a tighter ship than this. Tisk. What is this? Weird door. <laughs> Where are we going? Oh, treasure chest. It's down this hallway. Activate. There is a treasure chest in there. Hmm. How do I get in there, though? Run. I need it to be an arrow, right? Hmm. 
Presumably. That's not the direction I want to go in, though. There's a piece in there. I don't really know how to get into these other locations, if I'm being honest. We continue. I'll have to come back and investigate this floor later. will eventually need these for someone. <gasps> I could have just teleported. Oh wait, this was not the location I was meant to go. Whoops. I did all this for nothing. Owen back. At least it's so much quicker this direction. <laughs> okay, I need it. So when I'm looking at this, it needs to be pointing down. Whatever, we'll we'll just we'll try. Am 
Most humans could have the entirety of their fleeting lives chronicled in but a few short lines. Their stories really make for terribly dull reading. I don't think this is ever going to turn to be in the direction I want. not getting about this gear. Hold on. So it always starts in that position. So if I just turn this twice or three times, pick it up and then put it back. Huh. Traveling to other worlds is all that anyone seems to be writing about these days. <laughs> Goodness knows what they find so disappointing about their own world. No, it stops, however... Okay. I do not... Uh... Get this. it again. Personally, I think the idea of things staying the same forever is quite beautiful. Ah, oh, but alas, that is simply not the way the world works. I think I just don't understand how this works. Okay, what, where's the, where's the guide? Read. Okay, drive valve operations and safety manual. The drive valve can be used to rotate, open, and close the connecting paths for each area. The drive valve is controlled via both the core gear drive, non-removable, and the gear drive train removable. The non-removable core gear drive controls the central room, while the gear drive train controls the direction of each connecting path while operating take note that when the direction indicated by the core gear drive is opposite to that of the is opposite to that indicated by the gear drive train the path indicated by will be open When operating, take note that when the direction indicated by the core gear is opposite to that. Okay. The path indicated by the core gear will be opened. When all core gear drivetrains are uninstalled, the drive valve will automatically terminate operation. Geode mine shaft, energy storage. I think we want supply warehouse one. 
I'm pretty sure. I just don't 